welcome to today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread. Today's reading titled, Never Say Can't, was written by Allison Keita. Jen was born without legs and abandoned at the hospital. Yet she says being put up for adoption was a blessing. I am here because of the people who poured into me. Her adoptive family helped her to see she was born like this for a reason. They raised her to never say can't and encouraged her in all her pursuits, including becoming an accomplished acrobat and aerialist. She meets challenges with an attitude of how can I tackle this and motivates others to do the same. The Bible tells the stories of many people God used who seemed incapable or unsuited for their calling, but God used them anyway. Moses is a classic example. When God called him to lead the Israelites out of Egypt in Exodus chapter 3, he balked and protested, I am slow of speech and tongue. God replied, Who gave human beings their mouths? Who makes them deaf or mute? Is it not I, the Lord? Now go, I will help you speak and will teach you what to say. When Moses still protested, God provided Aaron to speak for him and assured him he would help them. Like Jen and like Moses, all of us are here for a reason, and God graciously helps us along the way. He supplies people to help us and provides what we need to live for Him. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Exodus chapter 3, verses 7 through 10, and chapter 4, verses 10 through 15. The Lord said, I have indeed seen the misery of my people in Egypt. I have heard them crying out because of their slave drivers, and I am concerned about their suffering. So I have come down to rescue them from the land of the Egyptians, and to bring them up out of that land into a good and spacious land, a land flowing with milk and honey, the home of the Canaanites, Hittites, Amorites, Perizzites, Hivites, and Jebusites. And now the cry of the Israelites has reached me, and I have seen the way the Egyptians are oppressing them. So now, go, I am sending you to Pharaoh to bring my people, the Israelites, out of Egypt. Now picking up at chapter 4, verse 10. Moses said to the Lord, Pardon your servant, Lord. I have never been eloquent, neither in the past nor since you have spoken to your servant. I am slow of speech and tongue. The Lord said to him, Who gave human beings their mouths? Who makes them deaf or mute? Who gives them sight or makes them blind? Is it not I, the Lord? Now go, I will help you speak, and will teach you what to say. But Moses said, Pardon your servant, Lord, please send someone else. Then the Lord's anger burned against Moses, and he said, What about your brother, Aaron the Levite? I know he can speak well. He is already on his way to meet you, and he will be glad to see you. You shall speak to him and put words in his mouth. I will help both of you speak and will teach you what to do. Let's pray. Father, we are so glad you didn't leave us here on this earth to do it all on our own. Thank you for your love and your guidance and the people that you've placed in our lives to help us and to encourage us. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for listening. I'm Rochelle Traub, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.